Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Otso and welcome back to the channel. Today is episode 80 of Pokemon Omega Ruby and today we are going to take on this lady. Don't really remember if she told us her name or not, but she wanted to battle. So here we go. Um, yes, we will battle you. That's my boy. Now let's do it. Give me a good taste of everything. You and your Pokemon have to offer. Okay, here we go. Not really sure who she is. Oh, she got a Mega Bracelet. Zinnia? Okay, why you look like a psycho? All right, her name is Zinnia Tyrantrum. Okay, I don't really remember. Oh, okay. It's a T-Rex. I think it's Gen 5's fossil or something like that. I don't know. Pretty cool looking Pokemon. But um, I'm guessing you're going to die to Waterfall if I had to guess. Especially since we're like nine levels higher than you. We should just be able to insta-kill you here, right? Unless you're resistant. Wow, what are you? Are you just normal? What are you then? Okay. Well, I guess we're pulling out the stops. We're, all the stops. We're, we're going with Mega Evolution and Earthquake. See how that works, because I cannot believe that he survived that. I, I don't know what he is. Is he, like, fighting or something? I don't know what he is. I've never seen him before, so I'm not entirely sure. And I can't really gauge off that, so we're just going to use Earthquake. Hope it works. Um, Let's see. How much is that going to do? Probably going to do a lot, right? I like how, like, Mega Pert, like, slams his fist in the ground for Earthquake. And it, like... I mean, look at him. He looks like he could cause an earthquake with that. Altaria. Hmm. Altaria is flying dragon. We don't really have anything to do against that. I guess Rosalina with Psychic maybe would do good. I mean, Saber and Rosalina could do it. I'm going to throw in Rosalina just because I feel like Rosalina can do more damage. I'm not really sure. Like, dragon is the one thing that we don't have really a counter for. Um, so let's see. So we'll use, um, Psychic and... Oh, no, we have... Oh, we have Fairy. We do have a counter. I'm an idiot. Completely forgot about that. Oh, my God. Moon... Oh. I think that should just do normal effectiveness to us. Yeah, okay, good. Um, what is that? Special attack fell? Okay, well, we'll use Drain and Kiss. That's gonna be super effective, and it should heal us up to full. So, goodbye, Altaria. Yep, goodbye. Let's go. Easy and... Full dubs. Let's go. Easy dub. And then I'm going to guess her ass Pokemon's up next. Okay, level 65, little pert. Let's go. Um, Salamence. Okay, no, we'll keep out Rosalina then. Um, I do need to sit down and train one day. Is she, is she going to have a Mega Salamence? I think I need to sit down and just train one day the all my Pokemon up to the same level as little pert. So that little pert isn't such a massive, like, advantage over everyone. Oh, Wait, no, that's just normal, right? Because I don't think it's very effective against... Or not. Oh, yeah, it's just normal. We use Drain and Kiss. I am surprised. I saw she had a, um... A Mega thing. So I would have thought that Salamence would Mega Evolve or something like that. But I guess not. Maybe we fight her again later, and then she goes against us with a Mega Salamence? I'm, I don't know. But, uh... Because I know there's a Mega Salamence. All right. Easy. Yes, that it. That's it. That's just what I was looking for. All right. Wow, you're going to pay me as well. I, I I love how they just pay you no matter what. Nice. Real nice, Otso. Oh, I really felt that one. Full points to you. That settles it. You get this Meteorite Shard as a reward. Awesome. We can now get Rayquaza, I'm assuming. Um, That's great. All right. Uh, What? Oh, is it reacting with the orb or something like that? That glittering Meteorite that you've got there. Hmm. It's sure giving off some vibes. I'd keep a tight hold on it if I were you, along with that shard I just gave you. Oh! With the one that we got from Meteor Falls. So we're going to be, like, combining them. I guess they're probably, like, shattered pieces that, like, get Rayquaza. Hey, the actions that you're taking now, are they based on ideals you're clinging to, or are they based on actual truths? And if they are, how much of the, the truth do you think you know? I probably know zero, if I'm guessing. I, I, I'm guessing. Yes, ma'am. Moving out. Such a spoiled girl you are, Aster. So what'll be our next stop? Hmm, sweetie? Okay, where am I going? I'm guessing going back to Devon? Oh, we're getting a call first. Also, were you able to find the meteorite shard that we need? If you were able to secure it, could you hurry back to us at Moss Deep Space Center? I'm afraid we don't seem to have much time left. I'll be waiting for you. Okay. We need to head back to Moss Deep Space Center. Got it. I, that makes it sound like the the meteorites like moved up in the um like the like the, the time frame 
or they found out something bad. Uh, hopefully, none of the above. Let's fly to Moss Deep. God, this cursor is so fucking slow. Let's go to Moss Deep, and I'm assuming... He said Space Center, right? I would assume so. That's where we're going. We're going to the Space Center. So, let's go get through this. I, I, the fly, That ball is just way too big. That ball is way too big. I want to say the flying animation takes too long. That, and then the ball is just way too big. Yeah, we can get rid of that. It's just way too big for my hands. Um, was it over here? No, no, this goes down to... Oh, shit. I continued going after I said no. Um, that goes down. We need to come up here. Is this it? Yeah, it's in here. Uh, I'm guessing it's going to be in the top room, like the control room that we're heading towards. Um, and that was like all the way up here. Yes, okay. Can we go up? No? You must be Otso. Mr. Stephen Stone told me he was expecting you. This way, please. Okay. Got it. Um, let's see. What's the situation? Professor Cosmo, if I may interrupt you. Oh, Otso, thank you for coming. And you brought the meteorite shard with you. Well done. Hand over the meteorite. Okay. I was rather surprised to learn that you knew the professor. You really do seem to make connections everywhere you go. How do I know him? How do I know him? I don't know where I know him from. I have no clue. Now then, professor, could I ask you to explain once more th about the current plan? Indeed, please come this way. I have no clue where I know him from. Is he the guy from the, the weather thing? Maybe? I don't know. I imagine that you've heard some of the situation for President Stone already. Our current plan involves using the infinity energy within our rocket. Combined with the life energy of humans found in keystones. We will start off by artificially replicating... Replicating? God, I don't know why that word was so hard. The massive energy that is triggered at the time of mega evolution. We will fire the energy produced from the, our rocket into space. Okay. And create a warp hole. That doesn't sound good. By creating a warp hole in the path of the incoming meteorite, we'd hope to be able to transport it somewhere far away from here. As a matter of fact, this technology already exists and has been incorporated in some of our commonly used devices. Uh, are we sending this to a different universe for another place to get destroyed? Is this the, um, oh my god, I don't know what, I don't, can't remember what it's called, but the, the Illuminati and Marvel did this. Where, like, the, the, the Earth's colliding, so they just had to keep on, I don't know, I think, I, I can't remember what it's called, but they, like, they, like, the Earths were colliding, so they sent them to different Earths so that they got destroyed in that shit with the Infinity Stones. I think, I think that's what we're doing here, and that is not a good solution at all. Okay. I think you know what I mean. I think he's talking about, like, PCs and that stuff, so we're going to send it to another universe that is exactly like ours. Not good. Um, those panels that spin you about, and then out you come, warp to another spot. I imagine you stepped on a few such. <sighs> you don't even fucking know. <laughs> An audacious plan, and using such technology, you would. May I ask where exactly the asteroid will be warped to? Well, we're not entirely sure, but we do have a device that links the warp holes. We named it the link cable, but there's no need to worry. Based on our theory, we can all at least guarantee that we will be sending it away from our planet. However, we've realized that we will need more energy than originally anticipated to control the link cable properly. I'm sorry to ask this of you, but with one more meteorite shard... Okay, I've got it. Oh, what's this going to be? Is this going to be the girl? Yep. Okay. Nice. So this is the heart of the famous space center everyone talks about. Pretty impressive, huh, Aster? Mur, mur, mur. Okay. What's up with her cape? Why did it get burned on the two ends, but not the middle? Excuse me, young lady, you can't just let yourself in here. Oh, where's the harm in it? Don't be such a stick in the mud. Right? Uh. Okay, what's she doing here? Who are you? You're not sight- you're no sightseer. Oh, me? We do seem to be keep running into one another. You're a busy boy, Otso. Wh who are you? What are you doing here? Me? I'm Zinnia. Just your regular old tourist, nothing more. Dreaming of taking a little trip into space, eh? Oh, I see. So this is what has come of human technology and of hope and blood and sweat and tears and... Well, the list gets kind of long and boring, but it contains everything, huh? I know all about it. About just what kind of energy you're using to fuel this rocket thing. The abominable technology humanity first thought up 3,000 years ago. So you're once again planning to claim that this is the best for humanity, or best for the whole darn world. It's a snap of your fingers to press the sins of the past. Worse, if what I overheard is true, this time you're about to commit an error more abominable than before. 
Tell me, would you rather we sit he here wringing our hands waiting for that meteorite, sh meteorite to strike us? Ha 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 ha. What's up with that? You're a pretty simple guy for a former Pokemon League champion. Then I guess I'll hang my hopes on what our current champion will have to say. So how about it, Otso? What do you think? Do you have some better idea? You bet I do. I don't, but I... Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll use Rayquaza or something like that. I don't know, we'll use something. We got it. Oh, really? Well, that's promising. You'll have to tell me so we can set these th guys straight. Look, I'm not here to criticize the way you guys are looking at this, but I want to be sure you've thought this through well and good. You know there are necessary sacrifices and there are unnecessary sacrifices. What a disappointment. This is the best you could do with all your knowledge and technology. Instead of trying to make something out of nothing, you'd rather repeat the mistake of the past straight up. No, you're going to add new mistakes on top of that. Really takes a cake. You guys need some imagination. Okay. Oops. But you were all in the middle of a conversation or something, right? Sorry about that. I guess we're just, we'll just let ourselves out then. Come on, Aster. Okay, so... She clearly knows something that we don't. I don't know what she knows, but she clearly knows something. Who was that woman? And the way she spoke to... Oh god, he's monologuing again. No, don't monologue. You always monologue. It's almost as if she came here for some kind of confirmation. And yet, I feel as though I should know her from somewhere. Okay. Ah, oh, Professor, forgive me. I believe you were trying to tell us something before that woman interrupted us. Uh, yes. Uh, you see... In order to complete the warp hole, we will need another meteorite shard, an extremely pure one. Then should we head to Granite Cave once again? No, the kind of meteorite shard we need this time can only be found at Meteor Falls. Meteor Falls? I see, perhaps we will learn something there. I will head to Meteor Falls at once. Follow as soon as you are ready. I feel we might discover even more than a meteorite shard there. Uh, don't I have the meteorite shard? I think I have the one they're looking for. And I'm just not talking up. Like, not, 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 not talking up. Not giving it to them. I'm pretty sure I have the one that they're seeking. So, I don't know. We'll have to move, to, we'll have to go to, not move. We'll have to go to Meteorite Falls. Um, Meteor Falls, not Meteorite Falls. Where was that again? It was up here, right? Yeah, it's the green one all the way to the left. So we gotta come to Fall Arbor Town and head out to Meteor Falls next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, leave a like and subscribe. It helps me out a bunch. And if you do subscribe, hit that notification bell. Notifies you every time I upload. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.